Hello everyone, I am Dr. Queen Aditya, Senior Consultant Gynecologist at Papilio Clinic, Kolkata. Contraceptive methods for both males and females are highly in vogue and should be because when we do not want a pregnancy, it is always better to go for a contraceptive than later on run to the doctor and ask for an abortion. Neither is it morally correct nor is it uh, good for the health of the woman. So, going for a contraceptive is the best way out. Now, the usual methods of contraception are all, already I have mentioned, there is a natural method of contraception. And when we go for an artificial method, then the methods are a barrier contraception, that is using of a condom, which uh, is used by the male partner. Nowadays, a female condom is also available, but it is not highly in vogue. The other ways that a female or the female partner can go about is... Uh, uh, combined oral contraceptive pills that is a combination of estrogen and progesterone there are various forms uh, available in the market with different kinds of progesterones and hence different kinds of formulations and some are, are better for certain women and some are better for certain other women which the uh, gynecologist will be in a position to decide which one is best for whom. So these oral uh, combined oral contraceptives are actually good and have a lot of health benefits. They can prevent uh, ovarian and breast ca cancers and hence uh, these are the added advantages. They uh, protect from uh, other infections. So they are good and they have another advantage that is they keep the cycles regulated and with timely menstrual cycles a lot of women are ready to accept them. Other than the combined oral contraceptives there are also progesterone only pills. Now these are pills which are taken continuously without any gap and uh, and the, uh, the advantage is that they do not have the estrogen part so women who have contraindications for estrogen can use them and that is especially women, elderly women and uh, in certain other conditions and moreover it is good uh, for women who are in their uh, lactation because uh, COCs or combined oral contraception can reduce the amount of milk and hence a lot of mothers will not want to go for a COC during lactation. Progesterone only pill is also highly uh, accepted by women all across the globe. Then there is an injectable, a hormonal injectable which can be given once in three months and that is also a progesterone. But the disadvantage with uh, progesterone only pill as long as as well as the injectable is that they can cause irregular monthly cycles and it might not be acceptable to a lot of women. Then there are also implants which are long term for long term use. They can be used for uh, 3 to 5 years and these are implanted in the subcutaneous tissue under the in the arm and they can be used for uh, 2 to 3 years even up to 5 years. So that is another way but they again can cause irregular cycles. Then there is something called an intrauterine contraceptive device. These devices are placed inside the uterus by your healthcare provider that is by your gynecologist and it will remain there from between any time between 3 to 10 years. Different form, uh, types are there for different kinds of uh, uh, tenures. Some are for 3 years, some for 5 years, some for 10 years. These are once they are uh, inside the body, they, the advantage is that nothing else is to be done by the woman. She does not have to re remember to take a pill or anything of that sort and cycles are also usually regular. But the disadvantage is that with some kinds of uh, IUCDs or intrauterine contraceptive devices, there can be irregular, there can be spotting in between periods, there can be spotting for the first few months or the period can be heavier than usual. And there are some uh, more advanced forms which contain progesterone hormone, something like a myrina, which uh, if it is placed inside gradually it reduces the amount of flow so women who are suffering from uh, heavy menstrual flow or anemia it is suitable for them because it will reduce the flow and it will give them some kind of relief so in a nutshell these are more or less the kind of contraceptives that are used <laughs>